Okay, good evening everyone and today video I'm going to show you how you can mirror screen from your Android phone to the Hisense Android Smart TV. Okay, now you can see my Android phone. I already mirror screen to this Hisense TV and to do that, you need to make sure that your TV and your phone are connected to the same Wi-Fi network okay now I'm gonna show you so first of all you need to see on the top bar of your mobile phone and then you go into find this uh, this this function it's called cache or oh, for my Samsung phone it's called uh, smart view or smart something but uh, the logo is the same it's uh, the same like this so you just press that logo and then now you will see your TV's name it's Hisense Smart TV and then select on it and now it's connecting to your TV okay and uh, it is uh, a bit slow and if you play a game when it show up in the landscape screen like this it will show the full screen on the TV but I feel it's very slow you can see I'm scrolling and the TV is uh, uh, just a, a little bit stuck on the screen okay and secondly I will show you the if you want more smooth display on the TV so you need to have some accessory so I suggest to buy this one the Type C connection convert to HDMI port and another one you need to have the HDMI cable Okay, now I already disconnect from the screen case and now we're going to test with this uh, Type C convert to HDMI cable. Okay, after we plug the HDMI cable to the TV and there's nothing yet happened to the TV screen All you need to do is just press this input on your remote control And then you will see uh, another option and here is the HDMI that we just plug HDMI 1 select on it And now you will see the same as I saw at the cache screen and let's see is it smoother than we connect through the Wi-Fi network Okay, you can see it's uh, much faster than we just connect through the uh, screen case. So if you want to have more experience on the TV screen, I suggest you to get this uh, accessory. Connect with the HDMI cable, you can feel it's much better. Okay, and if you want to disconnect it, just press the input again and now we go back to the Android home TV after that just uh, unplug the HDMI from the phone and from the TV and that's it 
and that is the end of this video saying to everyone for your time watching this short video and i hope to see you again in the next video bye bye and have a nice day